Welcome back to Mama Bear Mo's. On the previous episode, we had scored some serious loot, man. We got ourselves the Soul Render. We got a new plasma coil. I don't even, I don't know what we got on the last episode, to be honest, but we did get this. The cloning maddening tracker from a vending machine. So <laughs> life is good. We also got this minesweeper also farmed up this raging bear with action skill damage. So basically summon iron cub and let it just destroy the entire map. While I get bonus mag size and Jacob's weapon damage. So I can throw on Rowan's call or I don't know, clairvoyance or whatever and just go rip things apart. So we got some pretty damn good loot. I thought we'd start the day off today. Today is going to be the finale. So I thought we'd start the day off by killing a mock a few times because right now, as of the recording of this, we have loot the universe and it's taking place on Pandora and Xylorgos right now. And on Xylorgos, we can get some random ass cloning maddening trackers, but I'm cautiously optimistic that maybe the Pearl of Ineffable Knowledge might be world dropping because a lot of the other one-time rewards like the Ember's Purge had world dropped in the past loot the universe area. So I'm hoping, but I don't know that it's gonna work. Uh, we need to kill something else nope. before he Okay, never mind. We need to trigger our Schluter, but uh, Cub had other plans and that's kind of on me. All right, <laughs> let's farm. Oh crap, it's Rocky! Rocky! I got to kill you. Where are you at? I barrel trolled Racky. But hiding. Why are you always hiding? Okay, what was that? What is happening over here? Racky, quit hiding. Get get your ass down here. Thank you. Apparently we killed a mock already. Good lord, dude. Alright, so we got a Widowmaker, Flamadiddle. Got some stuff up there. We got an unseen threat. Another flamadiddle, a Merv Widowmaker, and a crossroad. Okay, not the greatest start. <laughs> Good fight, Amok. All right, what do we get on our final run here? An icebreaker safeguard. Cryostone launch pad. I still need an icebreaker victory rush, by the way. Cub, you're doing great over there. Keep it up. I don't even know what all's here, dude. This is going to assume nothing good. For me. Whoa! He got pulled by the spider. Okay. Don't want to fight you. Oh, I got pulled by the spider. Not cool, bitch. I was trying to do something and you interrupted me. Oh, there we go. Hello. What you dropping over here, badasses? Oh, there's another badass. All right, let's see if this badass drops anything. If we get stuff from the badasses, then, uh, then it would be kind of a safe bet that loot the universe is helping. Moment of truth. Yeah, we did get a dark army, just a single pluser. Not the worst run so far. Okay, so we got to go inward. Oh, hello, damn, dude. Okay, that guy dropped a couple of things. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, we're getting some drops now. <laughs> Spike shell, Beskar, gas mask, and a kick charger, okay. Suddenly, I'm like, but wait, hold on. <laughs> okay, my butt stallion milk has run out and I just got a binary operator from a gray chest. After getting two legendaries from one enemy, and then another legendary from a normal enemy. So maybe there is something to arms race being a little more lucrative than usual. Maybe slightly more lucrative than usual. I don't know. Oh, we got a coffer ant. Wait, is the coffer ant? That's not the loot ant, is it? It is the loot ant. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. Uh, clockwork res. Never mind. Things were looking pretty good. And then we got a clockwork res. And then we kill badasses and we get nothing. Them's the breaks, man. Them's the breaks. Oh, a cryo boogeyman with a, hey, that's a good anointment for me. Iron bear active, uh, freaking damage. Yeah, mini gun damage. Eh, okay, never mind. It wasn't that great of an anointment. I take it all back. Oh, great. Now we got revenants and I'm almost out of ammo. This could be a problem. <laughs> I need to go. Oh, there they are. They're still up there, man. Can they not get down from there? Are they stuck? Those stupid dummies. Oh yeah, dude. Ha <laughs> ha! Worth it? <laughs> Ooh. Ha ha! Ha ha! Come on! Oh man. And a trick shot. We didn't uh we didn't have to really try very hard. We ended up getting a plasma coil, uh toboggan, boogeyman, had the kick charger. I was pretty good think that's good for that i think we're ready to start doing our end game now <laughs> this is nuts dude 
Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Whoa, hello. <laughs> oh, God damn it, dude. Why? <laughs> oh, the Linoge curse is back. All right, Joey. This is the raid boss version, by the way. Cub doesn't give a damn. Hey, we got no pew pew. Nice. I didn't even put on the minesweeper, dude. Jeez, man. A ripper, a rerouter, and a fish lap. Boop. All right, taking that fish lap. So I, this, this isn't even optimized. We're not even optimized yet, guys. Now we got to turn on bloody harvest and get on. So I think to collect our things, let's go ahead and knock out another thing at the same time. Let's go do the slaughter star. Yes, it is. Hey, if you're a badass, son of a bitch. Nothing for you. I couldn't even finish my sentence and you guys were already dead. I'm so sorry. I was like, you're just dead. I'm so sorry. Oh, he's dying, dude. Oh, hey, what's up, guy? Oh, no. This is chaos. Dude, I've never had so much fun using the boogeyman before. <laughs> boogeyman on Moe's is just like so good. All right, let's go mess up this boss. Oh, hello, what'd you drop me? <laughs> never mind. Shot off your leggings. Cub, where are you at? What are you doing? Since Cub's not actually gonna help, I feel like I should probably go with the Minesweeper. Stop it, stop shooting me right now. Oh, the other one's shooting me now. Crap. Yeah, suck it, you bitch. Ooh, damn. And he threw his loot down in the hole, obviously. All right. About to go to the lost loot machine to get that one back. Icebreaker launch pad. God damn it. Gentlemen, ladies, boys and girls, cats wearing birthday hats and mommy. It is the finale of Ultimate Mama Bear Moe's and I need an Ultimate Mama Bear Moe's finale name. What you got for me? Bear necessities. All right. You know what? Bear necessities. Is that how you spell necessities? It is today. Bear necessities, the simple bear necessities. Get about your worries and your strife. Let's go, man. All right, we got a viewer badass. This time I'm gonna pause it before my cub kills you guys instantly like it did last time. Viewer badass is Chuck Mangione. And he's gone. Woo, are you the key master or the gatekeeper? Rip your eardrums. Now we're talking. Damn cub. Do your thing, Cub. What, what the hell happened to Cub? Cub, you suck! <laughs> there we go. When he shoots, he does damage. Thanks, Cub. Great job, dude. All right, for that, we got a bear trooper. We got a... Okay. So, such a delicious victory. Disappointed! Cub, Cub does that, man. He's just like, nah, I got stuff to do, dude. I'll catch you later. All right, well, there's Haunt and Joey done. So let's go ahead and knock out the Cistern of Slaughter, get that one done. That one's nice and quick and easy. Mr. Preza Bird, he flew right into that shit. All right, I'll switch weapons. Oh my God, what was that? Did I just kill myself with my own grenade, like from point blank? I, I don't even know what happened, to be honest. More explosives, bro? Are you sure you want to hit me with that one, Mr. Torg? For sure everything's exploding right now, buddy. What are you talking about? Including me? Maybe I should go through my Red Baron in the oven. Like if I go find a corner to hide in, Cub will kill everything. Let's put it to the test. Yeah, I'm getting XP, so he's killing stuff. He killed stuff. Hey, look, it's Tremendous Rex. Where's Cub at? Never mind, we're good. <laughs> All right, Cub, once you finish everything off. Get out of here, I'm trying to look at my loot. Cool, 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 cool. Neat. All right, we did it, Cub. Cub, quit trying to Goomba stomp people and just shoot them. Dude, look at this shit. <laughs> Whoa! What the? Hell? <laughs> okay, I got a new favorite sport. Leg soccer. Wait, that doesn't. Sounds like an oxymoron. A little bit of shred. A little shred happening over here. Oh, hey, look, it's Titan. And he's dead. Jesus Christ, dude. <laughs> so what do we get? A hippity hopper. Woo! Got that good shit. A damn a scourge. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and then we get a and then we get a hippity hopper from a vending machine. So I'm glad that we went through all that to get one from the final boss. Thank you for putting that in this loot pool. Okay, so that is all the slaughter maps. It's time to do the proven grounds. We're just gonna do them in order. Can't even see the guy. <laughs> he was so tiny. Alright, you need to quit shrinking, you little dick. Oh wow. Cub killed him while he was shrunken. That's amazing. <laughs> Alright, Cub. Let's see what you can do versus this raid boss. Not the greatest start. Oh, you know what? Hold up. 
I got something that'll help us both out here. All right, first phase done. Boogie and man. Got him. Skull masher. In this case, we got two skull mashers. Cub is aggressive, yes. Aggressive doesn't really cover it though, you know? He is genocidal, possibly a maniac. Challenge, okay. <laughs> like a new challenge awaits and I'm like, oh, okay, and it's dead. Didn't even get a chance to look at it. The barrel strike again. All right, now if we get fire resistance, then I'm counting on Cub to save the day. All right, good start, not fire resistance. No problem, his capacitive armature is getting resisted right now. All right, please don't resist fire. Please don't resist fire. No! Okay, Cub, what are we gonna do? I think we're gonna give Cub some Vanquisher rocket pods and hope for the best. Look at this health bar now, just barely moving. No! All right, Cub, don't nuke yourself, please. 2,000 years later. You took a nap, made lunch, but it's storing your back before the end of this fight. Yeah, dude. There's no raid bosses in this game, guys. There's no hard challenges. This thing resists fire. Moses is like, fudge. Sheesh. And for that, we got a Quasar, Dastardly, or I'm sorry, yeah, Dastardly Lucky 7, and another Lucky 7, because we couldn't have got those elsewhere. All right, cool. That should be the toughest thing that we have to do. I don't even know what I'm shooting at. I'm just holding the trigger and like aiming in directions where I think there's red dots. All right, here's the plan, guys. I'm just gonna give a capacitive armature. We'll see how this goes. Here we go, now we're talking. <laughs> okay, okay, here we go, all right. There you go, Cobb, keep shooting, dude. Yeah, all right, oh God, I almost died. Then I gotta, hey, we got a flipper, hey, with higher base damage. And it's shock and fire, nice. Thank you, game. And a chaos in, but it's not adapting, so that one can stay there. All right. Chaos is pretty damn good, guys. Badass viewer, where? Your badass is the real GIV. And you just got chaos in, son. You got KO'd. Now, I had somebody the other day in the YouTube comment section say, K6, that's not how you say this. It should be the Kaosin. No, no, no. It's the Kaosin because it's named after the lead weapon designer, Grant KO, and that's how he pronounces his last name. So it's the Chaosin. Now you know, knowing it's half the battle and all that stuff. Gee, I'm slow. Boomsicle. Hey guys, is the boomsicle any good? Do, do you guys know if the boomsicle's good? Add butter. I like it. I don't think that I wouldn't. All right, Harold Tom. Because I cannot believe that people think that the Borderlands 2 Herald is better than this. <laughs> this thing is much more precise. For number one. Number two, this thing can come in elements. Number three, splash damage in this game is so damn strong. You know, a Borderlands 2 version just doesn't have a chance to be better. It's not its own fault, you know? Just how it is. Let's go knock out Guardian takedown. Oh God, sometimes these enemies just like hide behind me so that my own grenades will hit me. It's pretty sneaky, but God dang it. As I was saying. Nice. Good run that time. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my God. I thought they were knocking me off of there, dude. Oh my God. That scared the hell out of me. Woo! Suck it in, Anthem, all the relentlessly stupid. Kick your ass. All right, what we got? Got us a Tientina, monocle, uh, and a white, a white, hey, but we got the white bang stick that we've been looking for, and a zappy bullet vamp. Woo! Piss off! Get off of my. Yikes! That was a little scary. Cub, what the frick are you doing right now, dude? Cub, where are you? Might have to come back to this one because Cub is doing a shitty job of murder. Oh my God. <laughs> Chaos. Chaos and doing work now. Chaos is like, stand back. It's my time to shine, you bitches. I'm like, yes, sir. Teleport me, daddy. I don't want to summon Cub out here because then he'll stay here when I get teleported back. Show him what you got, Chaos and yeah Kaosin! Kaosin coming in clutch now all right scourge that's the end of you get chaos into death Woo nice nice to be able to use the chaos in there we've been using the boogeyman soul render so much that i kind of forgot that i had other guns you know speaking of really strong weapons let's see what we got for that uh well we did get a smog i'll take a smog 
Got a web slinger. Sure, why not? Got a phase zerker with terrible rolls. Nice. A raid front loader, double delay. Hellwalker, actually, we got some good stuff on that run. I'm, you know, I'm over here usually shitting on this uh, this boss because, you know, we mostly get this stuff. But then we actually got some decent drops. Go take on Hemophorus and Vermiverus. Let's see how this goes, guys. I got a good feeling about this. I should have switched Cub to Hell on Rails, though, maybe. I don't know. Oh. Son of a bitch. That Mr. President was unexpected. Mr. Potident, more like it, you know? Cub, are you killing anything? Are you are you actually shooting your guns? Or what are you doing over there? All right, through the first phase. Moe's quit having gasms, okay? Listen, you're gonna get me kicked off the platform here. What's going on, guys? K6 back on the hub. There we go. There we go. Bye, Felicia. All right, now we finished off this dude, and then we done. Goodbye, Vermiverus. <laughs> oh my God, dude. Wow, we had a few minesweepers proc in there. Hell yeah, he over here dropping me stuff too. Usually we get nothing from him. Now to the Malawan takedown. Yeah, my gun's not making noise. Our game might crash. No, no, this would be a bad time for a crash, man. We're at the final thing here. Yeah, the audio is all derped out right now. I'm not getting like game audio at all anymore. Game audio appears to be completely gone now. It's Vira Virus! Vira Virus? Elvira Doom Boggy Doom Body Doom. I don't know how that song goes. Ooh wah, ooh wah, ooh wah, diddy. Talking about the boys from the New York City. That was on another infomercial, I think. And then you guys remember the one where it's like, is that Freedom Rock? Well, turn it up, man. That one was the best infomercial. Uh oh, we got us a frozen snowshoe. Don't mind if I do shoe. Splash damage heavy, flying off. No, we're good. Kick charger, but you know, whatever. <sighs> hey, vending machines. Hey, look, vending machines. Hey, guys, look, there's vending machines. You're like, wait, how can he go to the vending machines, but I can't? We have found the witch, might we burn, huh? Wow, we just cleared that bridge like lickety freaking split, dude. Oh my god, where did your health bar go, you stupid bitch? Yeah, you might as well just come on back down here. Whee! <laughs> yeah, that was really dumb, but I did it anyhow. <laughs> Yay! Sweet. All right, what do we get for that? Tank man shield, Malix Bane, <laughs> a carrier. We did get a times nine tigs boom. That's halfway to a good one. Hot drop safe card. Hey, we got a Kib's worth. I'll take a Kib's worth. That's cool. At least we got one good thing out of it. Guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough. This was really fun. Here's the final build. We used the Soul Render. The Boogeyman's like our main piece of gear right there. We got the one with uh, railgun damage so that while our cub was out running around doing his capacitive armature nonsense, we did extra damage just by holding this thing in our hand. The Plasma Coil was a popular pick. The Chaos we used there toward the end. Not really even truly anointed because uh, we weren't exiting Iron Bear. There's a lot of things that don't have perfect anoints on this, but you know, we still made it work. We used the super soldier most of the time, the old god when we we're using fire weapons. We just got the frozen snowshoe, so I'll keep that on the final build. Infernal Wish we used early on, but I feel like we didn't really even need it, so we didn't use it that much. We used the raging bear to let the cub do a lot of damage, but we also would use the blast master occasionally, the green monster, and the minesweeper when we were fighting mostly stationary bosses. We had this minesweeper with action skill damage, which was really strong, so we used that a lot. Pearl of Ineffable knowledge again didn't have perfect role in that either but we also used the toboggan a good bit and the schluter whenever we wanted to get loot the grenade we ended up using just the cloning maddening tracker just i say we also had a mitosis hex which we could throw the mitosis hex and just run and we would heal from that also other guns that we used along the way the complex root the roisin's thorn was good when we used that we didn't use it often boom sickle you saw that thing tear things up a bunch of flippers and various elements we used those mostly when we were uh trying to trigger minesweeper on Moe's but Cub did some pretty good work on this playthrough most of the time there was a few moments where we were just like Cub you know but uh all together it was a fun time here's the final skill tree that we did so uh like i said we used iron cub and we gave cub the fuel for the fire so whenever we inflicted status effect your armor would be restored on your cub we did the blueberry punch tree all the way to the bottom so that we had short fuse this was mostly for me i don't think cub benefits from short fuse so this was for me to do extra damage when it was when the cub was on cooldown for example mostly we did the pumpkin spice tree down to 
experimental munitions so we can have capacitive armature this is the thing that splintered shots when cub was doing railgun so it would like hit one enemy and splinter and hit another one it's really strong but we also used hail on rails uh in the mountain dew tree we went down to specialist bear so we got that extra 60 percent damage on our cub make sure that you do russian offensive on mose whenever you're playing as mose that's the best way to heal russian offensive plus vampire throw grenades run especially the hex grenade you do that combo and you can heal yourself back to full pretty quick so that's the build that was the playthrough hope you guys enjoyed when we come back we're gonna jump into ultimate flak next and the reason we're not gonna jump back to borderlands 2 is right now we got the loot the universe event going on in borderlands 3 so it's the perfect time for me to grind out another character and i need to rebuild my flak because again we deleted all my characters as a reward for people donating during the hunt for saint jude so that we raised a bunch of money for kids so well worth it appreciate you guys watching if you want to come watch these playthroughs live monday through friday over twitch.tv slash killer six there is a link down in the description below hope to see you guys there sometime and click on the links at the end of this to watch some other playthroughs i'll see you guys in the next one y'all have a good day you need to quit shrinking you little dick you need to quit shrinking you little dick little dick you need to quit shrinking you little dick little dick little dick little dick little dick, little dick.